too many of them. I've never seen a swarm this big. Well, make it out okay, Kaylee. Headquarters will probably give us a nice long break after this. Up ahead! Something big is coming! Damn it, that's a behemoth! have been breached. We'll be sitting ducks if we stay here. Courtney, Parker, let's hit them before they hit us. Damn bugs. Let's see how you like my fallout mech. Hit that behemoth with all we've got. Humanity depends on it. Strike is still recharging. Courtney, I need cover. Okay, fully charged. Have a taste of this. any longer. Headquarters, I'm requesting a launch of Weapon Alpha. Base 173. Strategic Weapon Alpha ready to launch. I'm obligated to warn you that Weapon Alpha is a weapon of mass destruction. This team is within its strike range. Please activate it on the console if you are sure you wish to proceed. at the limits of base number 173. No significant number of Grodd detected nearby. Deploying collector robot RR2. This used to be a strategic front line against the Grodd, so there may still be many resources left nearby. Please send out an RR2 to gather resources. We need sufficient energy to activate the command center. Commander, I've picked up a weak signal from nearby. We need to find out what it is. Please maintain caution. The Grodd could appear at any time. Excuse me, have you seen my arm? I lost it, and I can't move without the balance it provides. Who 
Hooray! My arm! I can't thank you enough. My guardian angel, you put me back together. I was working for a returner commander here, until he was eaten. So, who are you? And why are you here? You're also a returner? Then you're in luck. My name is RR7. I'm a Type 7 returner robot designed for exploration and aiding returners. There are many facilities that we can use around here. Oh, I see a solar plant under the fog there. Excellent! Come with me! Exploring fog-shrouded areas is my specialty. See? The solar plant is right here. Once activated, it can provide enough power for your base. Great! Now we can produce our own energy. Hold on, I just received a list of missions from headquarters. According to the list, our top priority is to rebuild a base. What was that? I've got a bad feeling about this. Oh no! It's the Grodd! We're doomed! We don't have enough firepower to stop them! Quick! Let's find a good hiding place! Looks like you got a little bug problem. Well, you're in luck. Old Parker can handle it. Calm down. I'm here to help. We need to set up a formation before entering combat. Mechs are my favorite type of vehicle. That's my buddy over there. Nice. Pardon me? Now we're talking. Fine with me. To set up your troops, we need more well-trained soldiers to operate mechs. These are my men. With them on board, we should be able to deal with the problem. Great, we're ready to rock and roll. Now let's go squash some bugs. Now we're talking.
This guy looks tough. I feel less afraid of the Grodd just by having him around. I think we should invite him to join us. I'll never say no to killing the Grodd. I may be old, but ten years ago I was an elite mech operator. The scavenger camp to the south of here has a lot of veterans. We should check it out. I reckon they'd be interested in taking on the Grodd. Rebuilding our base out here in the wastelands won't be easy. We could use more help. I've got bad news. The scavengers are starving and need food. None of them will fight on an empty stomach. We don't have much food left either. How much do they need? What do you say? Should we help those scavengers? Okay, let me see. 280 packs of food should be enough to feed all the scavengers. Also, this place used to be a mobilization center. We could use it to train these scavengers into qualified reservists. 280 servings of food coming up. I'll make RR2 start gathering right away. But it might take a while to collect all that food, since we only have one RR2. I got an RR2 here. It's another one of my old buddies. That'll help you collect food faster. Sounds great. Commander, now we can order both robots to collect food at the same time. Okay, RR2s, get busy. Those scavengers are willing to join us. They even turned their old home back into a mobilization center so we can start training reservists. The scavengers are here. With enough resources, we'll soon have a sizable army of reservists. A decent number of reservists is essential for victory. With okay, we're losing daylight here. Let's train our first batch of reservists. You're really putting our base in shape. Headquarters will gradually send us more building facilities. We're getting sent a solar plant.
building a solar plant can increase our energy production. Let's get to it. What the hell? Could that be the Grod? Scanning. Magnitude 3.5 earthquake detected. The source of- An earthquake? That's new. I thought it was the Grod. I'm not gonna lie. My circuits were buzzing. Earthquakes, the Grod. You never know what we're gonna have to face out here. We'd better collect as many resources as we can. Would you like to check your hero archives? Let me tell you, after the upgrade, their troop capacity will increase accordingly. And each talent has its own unique features, which are important for deciding whether or not a particular hero is suitable for various combat scenarios. Once upgraded, they'll be able to lead more combat units. Now let's replenish their formation with more units. As long as your formation meets certain requirements, the hero's special skill will be activated. There are lots of important details about your heroes here in the Hero Archives. You can always come back and check them out.
Oh my, look what the cat dragged in. Oh my god, Pops Parker! Long time no see. Yikes, that belly of yours only got bigger. Still moody, I see. What are you doing here? I was looking for the analysis lab to get the new weapon I ordered. You see that heap of ruins behind me? Yeah, that's it. Did I hear new weapon? Now I'm intrigued. You can fix that heap of ruins, right, Parker? Well, you're in luck, Max. You find me some metal and I'll take care of the analysis lab. All right, Parker. We can always count on you. Wow, Parker! I can't believe you turned those ruins into this shiny new facility! Never would have thought! I'll take the compliment. When it comes to fixing things, I'm your guy. Max, come on! Show us the new weapon you ordered! I can't- Right on! to analyze the drop pod. It'll take some time. Ooh, I love this feeling. It's like waiting to open presents. Wow, that's a big tank. It's a bulwark, classic and rare. It looks like most of its parts have been well maintained. That's amazing. Of course it's amazing. It cost me a fortune. Max, we're planning to rebuild the base right here, and we could use more help. What do you Rebuild the base? Here? You people must be crazy. Ah, you know me. I like it crazy. <laughs> yeah. Great, welcome aboard. With you here, we can finally set up a tank formation. Now, dispatch that tank to me. It's gorgeous. Add it to my formation. Hope I get to test drive it soon! Great! My special skill's been activated! Looks like me and the Bulwark really hit it off! With it at my side, I'm gonna be unstoppable on the battlefield! We already have some reservists in our base. I can train them to drive tanks. Nice. 
soon this thing will be grinding up the grot under its treads. I know how you drive, Bonnie. The grot don't stand a chance with you behind the wheel. Gee, Pops, why do I get the feeling you're trying to sweet-talk me into leading the next fight? <laughs> you got me there. Tanks do have a better defense, though. They make yeah, yeah, don't worry. 